Hello everyone, it's Jamie and welcome back to my channel and welcome to day nine of Flossmas. Yesterday was day eight and I worked on day eight of the Doreen Jones advent calendar which is from Etsy that I have been stitching on every day so far the month of December. This was day eight which was the cute little fox and uh, another change I made is I did not stitch the snow that was supposed to be there again. There was supposed to be snow around his feet and I was just like well we don't need snow that's more stitching than I want to do. Um, and then uh, someone I think had asked about the border color that I had used and the border color that I used is a DMC and it's 4520. I don't know if that is going to focus but it's yeah DMC 4520. I found this just at Michael's so they should just have it at craft stores and I'm stitching this on 16 count picture this plus in the color fresco. So there's that and day nine is the Christmas tree so I am excited to start stitching on the Christmas tree. And then I did not work on the 12 nights of Christmas stitch along once again because as we get closer to Christmas I am going to have less stitching time because there are going to be other things that are going to be coming up. Like I already know that on December 17th I am going to be at my parents house that day. Uh, we're going to be making Christmas cookies plus my sister will be there and she won't be there on Christmas because she's going on vacation so that's kind of like a little pre-Christmas Christmas gathering where she'll be able to be there and so I won't be stitching very much and so I think that for my advent calendar I might start stitching day 17 a little bit early like on day 15 I might start working on day 17 just because I know that on the 17th I'm gonna be busy so uh anyways that's just a little, <laughs> little side thing um and then yesterday for the project that I had picked out of my bucket to work on for the day I had picked the chart Sailor Moon which is from Tilt and Crafts and I looked on their website and I think that it's not available anymore. They do have other Sailor Moon charts which are very pretty, I like them all, but I, it's not available and then this is where I was when I started working on it. And this is where she is now. I decided I wanted to start working up towards her face because I really wanted to see how her face was going to look. And there is so much confetti in her eyes, like every stitch was a different color and so that took forever. This is being stitched on 28 count 2 over 1 tent stitch and I started in the center of this chart because I wanted to be able to start with the Sailor Moon instead of starting on the background because the background will take forever. And I am cropping off some of the background because it's not necessary when there's not any like details in it so there was that. And then now I will pick the project that I will be working on today. The project for today is a new start. It is the Stardew Winter chart, which is also by Glitch Stitch AU. It was, I think it was only a couple days ago that I worked on Stardew Autumn. And because it's a new start, I don't have anything to show on where I am. I will be stitching this on 28 count 2 over 1 tent stitch, so it will be the same finish size as Stardew Autumn. So I'll be back tomorrow with the progress that I make on my charts. So I will see you all tomorrow for Flossmas Day 10. 